Hello again. The overnight rain cleared out early, then it was dry for much of the time. The city began the day on 16 after that rain cleared. It peaked at 22.3. There is a breezy southwesterly wind, a bit of surf on the bay, but it's nice if you're out of that wind and in the sun. Our sky had a mix of sun and cloud. We weren't quite done after that rain band with a band of hit and miss showers. They cleared out early afternoon and there wasn't much in it, not even a millimetre. It was dry for the majority of the day. The warmer temperatures were in the west. It was 25 in Geelong, 21 at Phillip Island. The rain cleared eastern Victoria this morning. After del delivering generally less than 5 millimetres, there was the odd 10 to even 20, only in here, just about the ranges. There wasn't much cloud left by the end of the day on a mild public holiday. And Mount Buller only just reached double figures. And that was at 6 o'clock this morning. The remains of Cyclone Kiralee lost the wild winds but kept a big ball of moisture. That will continue to deliver rain over Queensland for several days, in fact, lasting well into next week. Meanwhile, we have this high-pressure system back over to our west. That's for the rest of the long weekend, keeping us on the mild side. It jumps on through later on Sunday, ready for a warm to hot Monday. All of that makes it generally dry. In fact, there's hardly any rain across Victoria over the next week. After Monday will be mild again with that next high moving back into our west with a mild stretch lasting through mid to late next week. Monday's your day if you like it warm. Around the nation tomorrow, Brisbane is dry for much of the time. A hot 36, there's the risk of a shower or thunderstorm. It does look grey in Sydney tomorrow, mild in Adelaide, warm and sunny in Perth with a weak cool change. To Victoria, the cloud cleared, but it's coming back. It spreads across the southwestern half during the morning and early and into the afternoon. But it is bark, not bite. It's only the odd shower near the coast and nothing inland. Mild to slightly warm in the northeastern half in all of that bright sunshine, winds are southwesterly, breezy in the southwest. Closer in the early sunshine, it won't last. We have clouds spreading through. But most of Melbourne does remain dry. It's just the Mornington Peninsula and Phillip Island that see the odd shower. The city begins sunny, a low of 12, so a cool start. Cloud does spread through around 10am and that will stick with us through lunchtime and the afternoon. But it's dry underneath and we peak at 23. To the eight-day outlook, a Sunday morning has a fair bit of cloud again. Light showers only in the outer southeast. And sunshine returns in the afternoon, expecting 24. The warm day is Monday. Bright sunshine, a top of 29. A bit of cool change does come through. There's the odd shower only in outer southeastern suburbs on Tuesday morning, a top of 23. There's a bit of cloud in the mornings through Wednesday and Thursday. Another brief spit in outer southeastern suburbs on Friday then warmer next Saturday. It begins sunny tomorrow, but it won't last. Cloud does spread through. You don't need the umbrella, though. It's 23, Mitch. Good news. Thank you very much indeed, Jane.